Welcome back, everybody. This is going to be our MRS 22 Spring 2021 test number one review, question number five, our fifth video, and our last one. I hope you got. I hope you caught the uh, first four, and I hope these are helpful. If you found any of these helpful, uh, any of these videos helpful, please give them a like and subscribe to the channel to be notified when new videos are added. And of course, leave any comments or questions below. If you are in my class, just hey, to let me know uh, what's going on and th what things uh, you know you're struggling with. This way, I can probably hopefully help you guys with with uh, future topics, with future videos. All right, ladies and gentlemen, question number five. How many how many people a certain disease affects is modeled by the equation i is equal to a times 3.5 raised to 0 0.621 t, where i equals the final number of people affected, a equals initial number of people affected, t is time in days. In a town, three people are infected with the disease. In approximately how many days will three people, three people spread the disease to 1,800 people? Round your answer to the nearest day. Only algebraic solutions will be accepted. And again, we will be using log base 10 in the, for, for our questions. So the first thing we see in this case are initial value of people who are infected of three. So that would be the A value, three. Okay? We're looking for in approximately how many days means we're not sure, so our t value will be the variable. And finally, will the spread to 1,800 people? And that's our final number of people infected, 1,800. So we're going to come up with our equation now using our model here. So we'll have i is 1,800 is equal to a, which is 3, times 3.5 raised to the 0 0.621t. And that by itself will give you credit, some credit for this, for this question because of the fact that you're being able to plug in, in the correct values into the correct places. Now, we want to isolate this part of the part of the equation to get 3.5 to 0 0.621t by itself. So we're going to divide both sides by 3. And we'll get 600 is equal to 3.5 raised to the 0 0.621t. We're going to use this equation to now uh, solve for t and since our variable is oops since our variable is going to be uh the the exponent we're going to use logs we're going to plug into here both the 600 and the 3.5 raises 0 0.621 t into the log function so we're going to get in this case the log of 600 is equal to the log of 3.5 raised to 0 0.621t. All right, so whenever we have an exponential equation where the bases are not equal to each other and our variable is exponent, we'll take, we'll both we'll basically plug the, plug both sides into the log function, log base 10. All right, so I'm going to kind of drag that equation down a little bit here because we have a little more space. So I'll bring it down here. Okay. And as always, to get the variable down so it's no longer an exponent place, we're going to bring this down. And of course, oh, just want to make sure we understand each other that the that this is this exponent is inside of the x is inside of the uh, of of the of the input for log. So after we use the power rule, we're going to get in this case the log of six hundred. Is equal to 0 0.621t times the log of 3.5. Now to isolate t, the very first thing I want to do is I want to divide both sides by the log of 3.5. So it divides everything by the log of 3.5 on both sides. I want to show this work, ladies and gentlemen. Do not take 
anything, any shortcuts, you want to show every single step to make sure you get full credit for this problem. So these divide out, and now we have here the log of 600 over the log of 3.5 is equal to 0.621t. But we don't want 0.621t. We want actually, in this case, to get t by itself. So I'm going to put a big bracket around this left side and divide both sides by 0 0.621. So t will be equal to the log of 600 divided by the log of 3.5 divided by 0 0.621. And what we're going to do is we're going to use our graphing calculator to find this value. So the log of 600, oh, got to put parentheses around the first part, so parentheses log of 600, close parentheses, divide by the log of 3.5, close parenthesis, twice, divide by 0 0.621. And that's what it's gonna look like, exactly what we wrote out before. And we are gonna get 8.22263603, which, so T is equal to 8.22, Two two, I believe we said two three twos three six point, and of course we're rounding off in this case, and we'll have eight days as our final answer. Make sure you put the proper units, ladies and gentlemen. So let me put this as a full page. We'll see how this is all done. Okay. So yes, you want to be you're going to score points for plugging the, the right numbers into the right formula. You're going to score points in this case to, again, know that we're going to uh, be taking the log of both sides. Of course, to do that, before we log both sides, we'll divide both sides by that, co that number multiplying that base. So we divide both sides by 3, right? And then we take the log of both sides, use the power rule, divide by log 3.5, and then divide by that coefficient of 0 0.621. And let the calculator take care of it. But make sure whatever you type in the calculator, you should be writing down on your paper. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thanks so much for watching. I hope this series is helpful. And of course, again, leave any questions or comments in the comment section below. And leave this video a like if you found it helpful. And watch it again if you need to. All right? Make sure you're showing every single step for every single question. All right? Good luck on your tests, everybody. I'll see you guys later. Take care and be safe.